Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in this video, we're going to be uh, showing you guys all the Halloween event prizes which were in the contract shop, not the shop in cases. I'm not going to be reviewing those, but I am going to be reviewing the ones that are in the contract shop. So you basically can't get anything in there anymore because uh, it's... It ended, not the Halloween update, it ended in like about 6 more days. So, anyway, we're going to be showing you guys all the Halloween event prizes from the contract shop in Arsenal. So, um, the first one is called Tetra. So, so here, so Tetra... This is probably, like, one of the creepiest, I think. Yeah, one of the creepiest. This is really creepy, despite, like, having so many eyes. But, holy Christ, it just follows you everywhere. Like, bro, that is the creepiest skin ever. But, yeah, that's the Tetris skin. I thought it was just gonna be called, like... I or I, I man <laughs> or whatever, but that's actually pretty funny and pretty spooky, honestly. Anyway, uh, let's get on to the next one. Next one, the next one, uh, we have is the Reaper skin. So, this is probably one of the top five favorites in this Howling update. Because this looks so cool. I wish I had the scythe with this, but guys, I didn't play Arsenal in 2019. So yeah, um, here is, uh, the Reaper skin. Um, yeah, uh, pretty cool, honestly. Uh, I really like this skin so much. But I attempt to use the Rabble Rouse, not Rabble Rouse, uh, Rotting Rouser skin because it looked... More cooler. And the cool thing about this is that, um, it has no feet. Like, it literally got cut off. Like, what the heck? Anyways, it got, like, some cool black wings. Oh, and get this. Um, when whenever you have, like, some sort of energy weapon, say, for instance, the Endbringer or the Energy Blade or whatever, it... It's actually black. Like, I think not in, like, your perspective, but in, like, other people's perspective. So, that's actually very, very cool. And it's the same as the gnome, but except, like, green for uh, other people's perspective. Perspective. My god. Anyways, um, let's get on to the next item. So, the next one is Frank, I, as in, like, Frankenstein. So, I did, like, got, like, a sparkle unusual for this, because I got, um, uh, 11 of them, minus the one that I've already got, so, uh, yeah, because I was bored. So, anyways, um, here's the Frank skin. Frank skin or Frankenstein skin, however you want to call him. Um, so yeah, uh, that's basically it. It's clearly just Frankenstein, guys. I might make a veil of Frankenstein in Arsenal, maybe, uh, soon. That would be, uh, cool. So, anyway, yo, yeah, let's move on to the next one. Okay, um, so the next, uh, item is Marinette. So, uh, this you can get in the contrast shop, and you can also get it in character cases, which I clearly didn't know until, like, a week ago. So, yeah, uh, here is, uh, the Marinette skin, and this actually looks cool, this... Clearly, it's like a puppet. So, yeah. Um, that That's very cool. I like the little strings. So, yeah. Uh, that is 
pretty much it for that. Anyway, y'all, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so the next one uh, we have is uh, Back in Pirates. So this is clearly a variant of the pirate skin. So yeah, Back in, pi back in Pirates. So yeah. Anyways, uh, here it is, uh, Back in Pirate. Now this, honestly, like, what the heck? I mean, like, wow. I was, like, very shocked when I saw this first, when I finally found the prizes. So, yeah, uh, that is pretty much it. That, this looks very cool. So, anyways, let's get on to the next one. Alright, next uh, one we have is Gaslight Detective. So, this is a variant of the detective skin. And I also got unusual for, for this. So, yeah. Usual sparkle for the Gaslight Detective. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, here it is. This looks amazing. Like... Like this cane right here, that looks cool. Uh, looks really better than the the other detective skin. So yeah, that is very very cool. Anyways, uh, let's get on to the next one. Next up, uh, we have the mo molen slat. Sure skin, so this is a variant of the slasher, and yeah, I got another usual for the uh, contrast shop uh, ended, so yeah, uh, this is the moon slasher, and this looks hot, I mean, this looks very, very cool, like, this, this is, like, better, like, bro, the... The axe on his head, like, man, that's just, like, Friday the 13th, bro. Like, real. Anyways, uh, this is probably in the top five of my favorites for this update, but shaking my head, this is amazing. Anyways, uh, let's get on to the next one. Okay, so next we have a uh, fallen veteran. So this is a variant of the veteran skin, as you can as you can see right here. So uh, here it is. This uh looks clearly like the deserted bar barret or barret or whatever it's called. Uh, back from the summer update from this year. Uh. Probably might be, but I don't actually know. But but this uh looks awesome. All these skins are awesome, honestly, in my opinion. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much that's pretty much it. So uh, so yeah, uh, let's get on to the next item. Okay, so the next one is the Alchemist Plague Doctor. So this is a, ver a variant skin from the Plague Doctor skin from last year's Halloween update. By the way, I don't have the Plague Doctor because, like I said guys, I didn't play Arsenal in 2019. So yeah. Anyways, um, here's the Plague Doctor. And this looks very, very cool. I know I say that like all the time. When there's like new skins, but but this is cool. Like like the little uh, I don't know little chemicals or whatever that is. Comment down below if you know what this is on on his uh, sash. But anyway, he has a cape and a hood over his head and like a and like a eagle beak or whatever like from the other plague doctor skin but this looks cool anyways uh let's get on to the next 
uh, item for this Halloween update. Alright, so the next two items, which are Skull and Day of the Dead, Skull Burrow and Day of the Dead, Skull Rita. So, uh, yeah, here's uh, Skull, Bur Skull Burrow and then we'll review Skull Rita. So, here it is. An amazing pink robe. Thank you. Anyways, um, here is the Skull Burrow Day of the Dead. I mean, Day of the Dead Skull Burrow. Um, so yeah, uh, this looks very cool. He has, uh, um, um, okay, back to what I was saying. Uh, this looks cool, I guess. Got, uh, 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 I don't know what, oh, wait, a, gu a guitar, well, I, I actually, probably, like, a banjo or something on his back, I don't know, and has, like, some sort of Mexican, uh, Mexican hat or whatever, like, from some sort of... Mexican restaurant, but whatever. Uh, this looked... This, this this skin looked cool. Sorry, uh, guys, for the words. Yeah. Anyways, uh, that is it for this. Let's move on to Skull Rita. Okay, so now... Next is Skull... Uh, Day of the Dead Skull Rita. So, yeah, uh, here is Day of the Dead Skull Rita. As you can see, she has that one mask that looks like the Roblox Skull mask that was actually free, uh, from the catalog. And, yeah. So, so, uh, she has, like, some sort of skull on her. Uh, well, some bone on her shirt, which that, uh, explains the name, Skorita. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm so funny, bro. I'm so funny anyways. Um, let's get on to the next, uh, the next item. Now the next item we have is the thriller emote. So, this actually got, uh, brought in back, but you can't get any more because, uh, the contrast shop, like I said, was, uh, gone. So, yeah, uh, finally got the thriller emote. So, yeah, uh, here's the thriller emote, and this is my favorite emote in Arsenal, but besides the no-touching emote, which is, like, probably my favorite. So, yeah, that is pretty much it for this item. If you press, uh, on your screen on mobile, it'll make that, um, thing. Um, but if you don't, uh, it just ends up like that. But still, very cool emote. I'm glad they brought it back for this update. But sadly got removed with the contrast, uh, shop. Well, like I said, the contrast shop, uh, was gone. So, anyways, uh, let's get on to the next one. Okay, so the next one is the dramatic kill effect. Or dramatic death effect, sorry. Um, anyways, um, just make sure you brought here it is, um, uh, I'm just gonna reset because why not? And... That didn't do nothing. Amazing. Hold up. I'm gonna try again. All it does is just throw some sort of thing, which that doesn't make sense at all. And whatever, that kind of looked boring anyway. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Uh, let's get on to the next one. Alright, so the next one is a weapon skin. So, 
it is um it is skulls. So this next one is skulls and um yeah. So as you can see, there are skulls on the railgun and on the melee and on my melee weapon, which is the pumpkin stuff. So it's probably my favorite out of the whole update. So yeah, um, this is cool. Anyway, um, let's get on to the next one. And I see that so many, so many times. Holy Christ! I should be. I should stop. Not nah, kidding. Anyways, let's get on to the next one. Okay, so we have four more items to go over. So, um, the next one is, uh, the pumpkin weapon skin. So, I actually In used this. Where Roblox carnage I actually used this before. Uh, and look at it. That looks beautiful. I should match it with the pumpkin skin, but I didn't put it on. So, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways, uh, this is really cool. Anyways, uh, let's get on to the next one. So the last three, um, are the police tape, uh, weapon skin, and, uh, the crazy chainsaw, and the witch's broom, which both of those are emotes, and this one's weapon skin. So let's see the weapon skin first, and we'll see the emotes. So, uh, here it is, the police tape, and what the heck? It's just, it's just this police. Yeah, whatever, uh, this looks, uh, semi-boring anyways. Not gonna lie, uh, no offense, Rolf. Yeah. Anyways, uh, here, here is, um, the crazy chainsaw of this. It's literally the chainsaw melee from the shop. Hold up. Oh, oh God. Okay, um, here it is, and you can clearly just run with this, but you can't kill anybody, sadly. So, uh, yeah. And here's the witch's broom, which is the last thing we're going over for this video. So this is clearly just like the skateboard emote, but except it's like a bit slower. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this review of all the event prizes in the Halloween update. And... Make sure to subscribe so we can get to 1,000 subscribers soon. And boom. I just died. And uh, make sure to follow my Twitch because I live stream there. And make sure to join my Discord server so we can get to 50 members soon. And also follow my Roblox group. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, uh, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.